<laughs> so do so do you so this is a I don't really think it's a stretch, but it's just an idea. Do you think whenever this probably maybe within this next chapter or two, I guess, do you think when Goku like kind of realizes what's within him and shit, like and it, he kind of taps in deeper within the Ultra Instinct, do you think the tail will grow out by itself? Wow, I didn't even think of that. <laughs> Kai, you wanna you yeah. wanna answer that first? Cause that would be dirty. But then like like will it now now the question would be after that is will it stay after or will it go back? I think it would stay. Uh that's a hard one. Oh that's oh, oh that's a great I think it one. would stay. I think it would stay. I love a challenging question. I love a challenge that's a great fucking question. That, that could go any direction and they could make it work. I'm telling you, bro. <laughs> they better steal my shit. I wouldn't man. even fucking be mad, son. I I wouldn't even be mad. People would literally, quite literally call that an ass pull, especially from how it looks. But, <laughs> dude. The the one thing I will say is this, in regards to that question. And then and then we're going to wrap. We're going we're gonna to keep going. And then we can go back to it. But... The one thing I can definitely say is that if that was to happen, that would, well, yeah, if it was to happen, either it would, it would, it would go away because if we look at the movie, there is no tail, right? But that doesn't mean, that doesn't mean that they purposefully animated what they did for the trailers on purpose and just didn't include it, right? Because and I can and in and, and here and so I'm basically what I'm doing is I'm playing devil's advocate here. I'm I'm literally giving you both ends that it could work or it's not. Nah, I totally forgot about the movie. You just reminded me, so I'm gonna go with nah. No but no, but no, 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 wait, wait. Here's my here's my other point when it comes to that though. All right, Spider-Man No Way Home, ten out of ten, greatest fucking Marvel movie of all time, better than Endgame. Never changing my mind about that. When they released their trailers, okay. When they released the final trailer promoting the film, there was a scene that was very deliberate. And because it was all CGI, they were able to remove elements, aka a cer certain characters from that shot. Where when you go see the movie, everybody's in place. Now, I'm bringing that in, I'm bringing that up because there's also a thing called trailer trickery where tr their trailers will literally do that. They'll have, they'll, 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 it's almost like they create some sort of illusion. Like you feel like, oh my God, like how is this going to happen when it looks like it's one on three, but realistically it was three on three the entire time, but you won't know that until you go see the movie because we have that kind of technology now where, especially with these superhero films, you can literally shoot something or you know produce it in a certain way but literally take certain portions out for a certain time period so that you're not spoiling something that's a major and the trailer does still serves its purpose for hyping up the movie and giving people you know enough of a reason to go out pay it for a ticket and go watch that bitch right i feel like a tale in Dragon Ball's perspective, especially since, you know, they're kind of going in a similar direction with, you know, it's all CG and, you know, all that kind of stuff for this movie. I'm pretty sure a tail, if Goku was to get that shit popped out right here, wouldn't be a challenge or, an, uh, or a problem for them at all. So just, just for food for thought. And also, I will add this. The movie got delayed. I don't know if you guys heard about that, but I did. Toei recently got hacked, and a lot every single like like it, it looks like a lot of their projects, like One Piece, everything got affected. So it it indefinitely, immediately, kind of stopped everything that they was working on, and delayed everything. So it's original. Oh. It, so it's not coming out in Japan next month anymore. It's most likely gonna come out later this summer so do you think they're like redoing parts of the movie then well not redoing but what does this do this could be a, a a blessing in disguise because now they can 
make it they could work on it more and make the animation like really really good i mean it's pretty it, i'm not saying they're not they're gonna go from what it looks like now to just call knocking on shintani's door and being like oh hey can you make this shit look like the broly movie please in a few months like i don't think that's how it's gonna be at all they're still gonna stick with that but i'm sure it'll maybe hopefully look a lot better and yo i'm not even gonna lie i don't even care about the fucking animation quality anymore i really don't because that is the last thing that i i care about just off of what the fuck is pretty much gonna happen in that movie but that's 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 another topic in and of itself oh that's that good shit